The border closure unveiled, President Biden's immigration challenges, and the leaked immigration bill. Lately, there has been a lot of talk about President Biden's decision to close the U.S. border. This means that people won't be allowed to enter the country from Mexico for a while. The reason for this is because there are too many people trying to come into the U.S. and it's causing problems. Today, we'll take a closer look at why the border is being closed, what the new immigration bill is all about, and what it means for everyone involved. So let's get started and learn more about this important issue. The border battle intensifies. The situation at the border has become very serious. President Biden has made the decision to close the border between the US and Mexico. This is because there are too many people trying to come into the US and it's causing a lot of problems. In December, there were more than 302,000 encounters with migrants at the border. To put it simply, that's like the entire population of Pittsburgh trying to enter the country. This has put a lot of pressure on the people who are supposed to keep the border secure, so the decision was made to close it for now. Immigration crisis and congressional battle the issue of immigration has become a big problem that Congress is trying to solve. There are people from both political parties who are working together to come up with a solution. Even though former President Trump wanted to close the border right away, there is hope that a deal can be reached. President Biden has said that if Congress approves the plan that is being worked on, he will close the border. This plan is being discussed in the Senate and it has support from both Democrats and Republicans. The Retired Assistant FBI Director's Warning A retired assistant FBI director has sent a letter to lawmakers to warn them about the security risks of the current situation. The letter says that it is important to secure the borders and catch people who are coming into the U.S. illegally. The large number of migrants is causing problems for cities and states, and it also affects how many representatives each state gets in Congress. The leaked text of the Senate border security deal. Some people who know about the negotiations in the Senate have leaked the details of the proposed deal. This deal includes things like closing the border if there are too many encounters with migrants, immediately sending back people who come into the U.S. illegally, and detaining single adults. The deal also gives more power to remove people who don't have a valid reason to ask for asylum. If someone tries to cross the border twice during the closure, they won't be allowed to enter the U.S. for a year. Making progress with border security. Even though there are still a lot of discussions and negotiations happening, it seems like progress is being made when it comes to border security. There are different ideas being proposed to address the problem. The proposed bill includes things like giving more money for border security, hiring more border patrol agents, judges and officers, and using better machines to find illegal drugs. President Biden says that there needs to be emergency powers to close the border until things can be brought under control. The urgency of fixing the broken immigration system. The immigration system in the U.S. has been broken for a long time, and it's important to find a way to fix it. President Biden wants Congress to pass the plan that is being worked on because he thinks it has the best solutions to secure the border. However, there are some Republicans in the House of Representatives who might try to stop the plan because former President Trump is pressuring them to do so. This could make it harder to find a solution that works for everyone. The Impeachment Effort and Political Maneuvering in a surprising move, some Republicans in the House of Representatives are trying to impeach Alejandro Mayorkas, who is in charge of Homeland Security. They are doing this because they think he hasn't done a good job with the border crises and the high number of people coming into the U.S. Some people think that impeachment is the only option, 
but Democrats say that it's just a political move and not a serious attempt to solve the problem. The decision to close the U.S. border and the ongoing discussions about the immigration bill show how complicated the issue of immigration is. President Biden and his administration are facing many challenges in dealing with the large number of people trying to come into the U.S. and keeping the border secure. The leaked details of the Senate's proposed deal give us an idea of what might happen. However, there are still political obstacles to overcome, and it's unclear how everything will be resolved. We'll have to wait and see what happens and how it will affect the immigration system and everyone involved.